Round here, and I'm here with a special crowdfunding pot project that we have going on at the moment. Uh, we talked to Michael Astorita, the one who originally sent us the tatami armor, the folding tatami armor, and we tested it out fully. We, we did a lot of testing on it. We're actually going to come back and do some more testing with this armor. And uh, not only did we test it for mobility, to see how well one could fight in it, uh, take falls in it, climb in it, uh, do gymnastics in it, or uh, uh, okimi, uh, we also uh, tested it with actual live blades, like the katana I have here. Uh, we tested it with this, but of course, Japanese weapons, I mean, it was meant to stand up against. We even tested it against a European sword. Uh, right now, we're asking for your help to get the uh, uh, Nimado uh, Elite Samurai Class Armor. It's beautiful. This is actually more of a plate style armor. We're talking about the dough is solid. Uh, we have the fluted style helmet. Uh, it's extremely hardened, the metal, uh, and even though it is a lighter gauge, it's an 18 style gauge, or maybe a hair thicker, uh, it's extremely hardened, and we have multiple layers, and it is the full deal. We're talking about Kusari on the arms. Uh, you, you have everything to this armor. This is going to be the extreme test. But to uh, do it, Michael Astorita has said that he'll match dollar for dollar, it cost around uh, $2,000 for a suit of the armor. Plus, he said he'll throw some extras in for us and so on, stuff that we might need with it or would want. Uh, but anyway, uh, if you go to uh, gofundme.com slash thrand, uh, you'll see there, I think we're at uh, $50 at the current time uh, from two donations, and we appreciate that greatly. Uh, we're going to try to find some methods of rewards, maybe some T-shirts or something soon. We're working on that for people with uh, larger donations. But I think you will enjoy the results because we want to dispel all the myths and rumors about Japanese armor, whether it's weaker or... Um, I mean, we already know that it's not all made out of uh, leather or, or uh, lacquered uh, bamboo like a lot of people think and so on. This is actually traditional Japanese armor made, made like it would be from a museum. These are replicas of actual historical armor. So I think it's going to be a, a uh, great project. I hope you enjoy our little campaign here of trying to actually procure the armor because it's the only way we'll actually be able to test that on our channel and we appreciate all the donations that we do get and people helping us out because if without it we wouldn't have a channel like we have now we wouldn't have the arms that we have the armor that we have and and things that we need to do our type of experimental archaeology and uh, bring it to fruitation so uh, if you can help out go by there uh, there'll be links down below uh, I'll put links in the video you can go straight to uh, GoFundMe.com slash Thran, and uh, be sure if you can give us anything, we'll greatly appreciate it. And as always, farewell.